the summer time is coming and the trees are sweetly blooming and the wild mountain time grows around the blooming heather will you go and see and we'll all go together to the wild mountain high, all around the blue and heaven. I remember Saturday mornings at home in William Street. Um, you know when you wake up on a Saturday morning and realise there's no school today and the boys, used to, my brothers used to be uh, sleeping in what we called the garret, which was attic I suppose you call it nowadays. And the next thing you'd hear the singing coming from the garret and maybe a mouth organ and you know. Just, I think, the joy of realising it was Saturday morning, but that's the first memory I have of them actually singing. The Tunkur Harigna Shura Hunta Hebradaran agree Larna Hebra a Hosnik McClancy's Nakagadi. Bun leader to Spontish if we give Weimar a sail, to side of their Hidva the Kultur in the Hotisha. Massam Hingo will go Kultur now, Kutinthanshar, Ervalach, Balivyog, Koshna Shuida, either. Even a man, I guess, in a comerig, I guess, than than Balia Hain sits in Eshka Tebridor and no ach lovely le potlarige, I guess, le kilkunig, I guess, I'm kiana. I guess, massum grev severus nevkatient of Dabrishan sterul, I guess, I guess, massum Hain grebe an 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 tradition con ash toracht, I guess, dramiacht, kiantas nodi bahakti a winless ne clancies. Agus Binrod Hushid Ishtach in Snashona, Agus in Sotlero, a death of Shid Hurabon in Norvig Clue, Agus Kaller for the Down, Erin Rupa. Agus Bishan Lider and Malisha, Kurgas, the Auckland and Malisha Gaki at Brianohin. Would fear not cut into death or all? No, we do. The whole last line. So, and then. The Lian Nadia Nocheshe, who in the Clancy's, the er Hamkurt Dernach, er Ordna Egg Sula, er Food Natira. Near even Halla, a Garig Nashura, Mura Rohan, I guess called her two stash a gold, a glun mala, while at her of Ruch Nashura, Homa. My father was an opera buff, and we learned all when he was babysitting for us, he would uh, tell us the stories of the operas and sing the parts to amuse us. He'd sing soprano or bass, anything that came along. Our nets and gear were fair. On the wild and wasteful ocean, it's out there on the deep that we harvest and reap our bread as we hunt the bunny shores of Herring. People would just sing. It was the most natural thing in the world, even if you were walking around the house or sweeping the floor or whatever. My mother was always singing. Well, I suppose when I, I remember it as being always, but I'm sure it was probably when she'd be in good humour or feeling, you know, in a good mood and that. But my mother was a great one for the sing songs. She really loved um, settling down and, and having a sing song. Now, that wouldn't happen very often, but on occasions, and the least excuse would do her, you know, to have a little sing song. I had an Aunt Mary Jo, and her house was a great house for courtie, as they used to say, for the gathering and singing and fun and t set dancing. And uh, that happened up there a lot, and I used to, I enjoyed it. 
and I learned a few folk songs there and I learned little old local songs from my grandmother and I thought that she was the only one in the world who knew them but I, I met a Scotsman I was in India one time I met a Scotsman and I was singing the frog in the well and he started singing a Scots version and I was amazed that he could know it you know Bi ad Paddy agus Tom a vog America ar dhush is na caig a di vog de har nis oig a liam tam lin yeson vi ahne ag liam Clancy ar Tommy Makem as ard vaca Liam Clancy and I were in an, a play together called uh, Shadow and Substance and the play had run for a number of months off Broadway and was going to close in a couple of weeks and some men came to us one night said they were opening a folk club and would we go and sing for them uh, at that time you got $45 a week off Broadway acting that was your pay that was the same as you got in unemployment uh, so we asked them how much they were paying and they said well, we'll give you $125 a week each and we're young men because we figured we'd sing a few songs at night and uh, we'd have all day to look for proper work in the theatre uh, so Liam and I started to sing and uh, Paddy and Tom Tom was in a play on Broadway I think at the time uh, Paddy was running the office of Tradition Records and uh, and some not night they would drop by and then they'd get up and sing on stage but I remember Liam and myself uh, we didn't know anything about it he could play guitar a lot of the songs we sang were had been sung by other people but very often in Irish tenor voices or or solo singers beside the fire like Brendan on the Moor was a famous old ballad but it was it was sung uh, Brendan on the Moor Ah, Brennan on the moor. He was brave and undaunted with young Brennan on the moor. But when we were rehearsing, we were in this apartment in Grange Village, and I was sitting on this couch that had springs in it, you know. I said, let's try and get the sound of, like if we could belt it out like highwaymen, you know, and get the sound of a galloping horse. And because the couch was going like this, it just got down. Chung chaka 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 chung chaka 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 chung chaka 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 chung and it's Brennan on the moor, Brennan on the moor, bold, brave and undaunted was young Brennan on the moor. One hundred pounds was offered for his apprehension there, so he would cross and settle to the mountains dead repair. Dead young Brennan on the moor. And we knew that we we'd established something very new. We'd established a new way of singing old songs. The Draw me a town, or to be ground on, or this sort uh, performance to be on, like Vakamis Hana, or Christian on Tartus the Russians, the Hauran. Uh, 